all right people as you can see we can't we are back at taylorsville again it's me and doug today last regular season tournament of the year in the taylorsville series we're gonna try to bring home one more win on this lake this year see what we can do we're starting on these stretch of brush piles that we caught some pretty good fish off of last tournament i'm gonna try it out for a little bit i think we're both gonna kind of chuck top water around for a couple minutes but inevitably i'm gonna pick up a chatterbait and i got so many bugs stuck to my glasses i can't see out of them. oh it's awful Look at them bugs. it was terrible <laughs> <laughs> but uh yeah we're gonna get started here and hopefully we can figure them out today Looks like that water temp's gonna hover right around 76, 76 and a half. So it's came down quite a bit since the last time we were here, but still pretty dang warm. Starting to get to where I can see at least. A little rough this morning. It wasn't a fun run for sure. I never did see anything, so. There's one, good, good. I'm flipping him. He might keep. He's going to be close. Ow. He was hooked good. I don't think he'll be 15. Ah, damn, I just broke off. Did you? That's what I don't like. On a bite? Yep. That's what I don't like about them leaving. Got to have them, though. Let me measure this one real quick. Yeah, he's 14 and a half. Oh gosh, I don't know how well you can see him, but hey, let me let me give you one of those. There you go. There he is, 14 and a half. See, you, buddy. All right, guys, caught that one on the Thunder Cricket. Chatterbait has became one of my favorite baits as a recent. He had a bite off that same brush pile. It just broke him off, so I'm gonna. I'm gonna turn us around here and get us back on that same brush pile because there's a couple fish in it for sure. He caught one. I did. Little worry mouth. You know what that is? Catfish bait. <laughs> it's about the perfect size. <laughs> he is. The big flathead love him. Uh -huh. <laughs> fish that little area kind of like where I caught that other keeper all the way to the point. Got one? Break him off, damn drag ink. I don't think he'll keep, but I'll net him for you. Uh, he's probably about 12, 13. First fish of the day for you, though. Never a bad thing. He ain't huge, but just getting a couple in the boat right now feels good. So, yeah, I'd say he's about 13 something. That probably ain't far off. Yeah, he ain't even 13, he's about 12 and three quarters. 12 and three quarters. Planes, trains, and automobiles. Oh, golly. I jerked a rod out of my hand, literally, but. Little single engine. Yeah. Yeah, we are moving. Not too far. All right, fellas, we moved. Not too far. I want to go hit this little crevice that I've caught three keepers out of in the last two trips so we'll work our way up to it here for a second but i'm gonna probably stick with chatterbait quite a bit here there's a fat one oh. see i cleaned him another warm out there there's a bass. yeah that one was a bass that's a bigger one a little warm out i think we might have to go down the creek Ain't out here on the main lake, I don't think. It's not boating well, at least. 
Look well, guys, that little spot right there, it always provides a fish for me on chatterbait, but he, uh, he's about 13 inches, guys. Apologies for missing him. They do like that little indent right there. I don't know why they like this little spot, but I always catch a fish right here. You know, you got one? Yeah. Ah, oh, you got off. Is they good? Yeah. Okay. <laughs> There's a couple laying there, just not as big a quality. Yeah, the big ones have left this. I think. Well, I think we I think we fished to the point and we need to go try something different because they are not here. At least the quality isn't. There's one. There's one. Yeah. I don't think he's real big, but I can't tell either. He's long. <laughs> I don't think he's going to be no 15, but... I'll check him. Yeah, 13 and a half. Well, fish number three, guys. Everything I've had on Chatterbait today. See, you, buddy. I mean, they're eating this Chatterbait, but there ain't no size. Oh yeah, I mean, you'd be able to. Golly, son, I thought that was him. <laughs> I thought it was him. I'm all jumpy now. All right, fellas. Caught that last little one there. We're going to move. There's just... The quality isn't here anymore. So, we're going to try to follow the bait fish and see if we can come across some better quality bass. All right, fellas. We have made our second or third move of the day. I've lost track at this point, but... We've pulled up on a bank I've had some luck on earlier in the year when the water temp wasn't nearly as warm as it was a couple weeks ago when we were here. I just think they're kind of starting to push back into this river arm and the creeks. So we're going to give this a go for a little bit and see if we come into any better quality than we were on the main lake. We're good. Yeah. Got one? That's a good one. Good deal, man. Well, he's stolen us in there talking to you. Drill. Uh, I just hope it ain't a drum. I ain't seen it yet. Keeper of the day. Uh huh. <laughs> <laughs> we get him here for It's gonna say away. It was staying down. I didn't think it was gonna be a bass, but here are some pliers. Well, hey. I'm sitting there talking to you. He's on the bottom. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, I was gonna say, Sonny. He clobbered it. All I heard was. See you, buddy. There's one. Good. That and a key. Yeah, that's big. There we go. It's a fat rascal. I think I got the wrong bait on there. Ouch. I got another one. That's a strong fish. Yeah, it's probably close to three. He's healthy. 
I said he's close to three. Damn chatterbait. That's the only one thing quality size we've seen today. Oh yeah, he's like 18 and a half. That's three, three something for sure. He clobbered it. We got one. That's a healthy one there. That's probably say he's three, three and a half. Solid fish for sure. We got a lot of time left, so we may be able to piece it together here. We came back in this a little bit closer to the mouth of the river on a channel swing bank, and they're on it. We'll retie here just to just to say I did. In here, I'm letting it sink four or five seconds, maybe a little less, depending on what structure I'm around, because they do hang a lot more in like a spinnerbait would, but not a straight retrieve at all, and slower. I wouldn't say just crawling, crawling, but slower. And I'll pause it, twitch it, random stuff. That one ate it on a pause. But no, I've not I've not gotten any bites on just straight retrieves. Heck, two of them I caught up there. I just like hit the bottom and they ate it like a jig. Lifted up and they were there. Oh, they will. They most certainly will. Yeah, he ain't, he ain't big. He ain't big. I popped it over at log and he ate it. Put that net. I got you. I know he ain't gonna be no keeper, but I'll give him a courtesy bump. Yeah, he's about 13 and a quarter. All right, well. I don't even know. That's fish five, I think, for me. Decent one, though. Honestly, I think we found the right bait now. We just gotta find the right fish. Yeah. That's the issue is finding the right ones. I mean, that drop trout's good. Oh, my little fish. Oh yeah, it does. It's a big fish bait too, though. You catch them bigger than that, but it's chatter bait, man. It pound for pound, it's. It produces big fish. I was eyeballing it a minute ago. <laughs> you know what these people fish are? Good? No. Little. These people can fish all these things they want to do. Unless you got the right bait to catch them, they ain't gonna bite it. Oh, there's another little one. Anyway, she's about to go right by him. Got one? Fish. Yeah. I don't know if he's good or not. He ain't fighting now. He ain't too big, but. Yeah. I'll net him for you. He don't like getting hit. I believe he's around a stump on me. Was he? He's about what? 12. 13. Yeah, he ain't bad. At least we're catching some now because some consistency going. Doug, you ain't getting skunked today. <laughs> I just can't get the three, four, three pounder. All right, people. This spot was pretty good to us. We only got one in the well, but it is a really solid bass. We still got a little over two hours. We caught three or four down through there. Though. Caught a bunch, yeah. Caught a bunch off of it. We've we've figured out a pattern at least, which is good. But we just need a couple more 15s. We're gonna go hunt for them for the next two hours and just hope we come across them. All right, guys. We have moved spots. We've pulled up on a point. We'll probably fish down a lot of this bank around this edge here. But there's a lot of wood on this. 
Three pounder going up. We need a couple threes. Dougie's got to have a three. <laughs> There's one. Oh no. Yeah. Uh, I don't know if it was big or not. I had I had two real handle cranks and that was it. He was gone. Yeah, I'm about to move. I think one more cast here and I'm all head out of these stumps. I had all the confidence in the world and this baby all going now. I had one bite up. All right, guys, we've made another move. Have not fished this spot this year, but have seen some pretty good fish come off of it in the past. Kind of the same kind of time of the year and water temp. Nice channel swing bank. It's a little deeper than what we just came from. So a lot of shad in the area. Hopefully we're gonna get on them here pretty quick. I just had that one I lost off that last spot. That's one. I can't tell. He spit it. He wasn't big enough. He spit it right at the boat. He's probably about 13, 13 and a half. Did you see that line though? Good lord, son. I pitched there and it was... Oh, running off with it. Look at that. Rip my skirt down, everything. Talk about really pulling your pants down there now. <laughs> I'm just gonna avoid this conversation. <laughs> you gotta know, gotta know your spots sometimes, when to avoid. That was definitely one of them. He made the, he made the right decision, I would say. James told me it's about There's one. He's about a week later, he's anxious. He said, I don't even know what the fuck to do. That's a real little one there now. Real little one. All right, fellas. We got roughly 20 minutes. So we moved back real, real close to the ramp here. We're just going to fish a little bit of this timber, a little bit of this rock for about 10, 15 more minutes. And we're just praying that we come across a big one. Three six. Yeah. Three six. Three, three six. six. All right, add them on in there, brother. Got another nice one. Jeez. Eight. Like eight oh. Eight oh. I think it was eight oh. Yeah. I don't know how to stop them from doing that. Nothing you can do. They'll get tired. Eight. Eight oh. It's an eight oh. Like yeah. Yeah. Every time. Go, every time they pause, eight oh. That's four people. That's all. Yeah. yeah that's all we need. Four times back to back. We can sell it. Yeah. What was big? Three eight. Three six. Three six. Yeah. That's a good. One. Okay. Let's find them. Let's put a four in there. AD. All gone. Empty. Right. Yeah. It'll be close for big. I think they might have us a little bit. But. It's a good one. Call me his ass down the bag. I knew it was going to be like right in that yeah. area. You'll know because he's thick. Definitely right hand looks like it. Yeah, no, right hand. Don't, don't let me tell you, but yeah, I say they're close. Right, see, zero, zero, everybody see a zero. Yeah. 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 I think the left hand looks bigger. Left hand looks longer. I think I think right's going to be heavier though. Yeah, it did look thicker. Yeah, he's poor as a snake, battle scarred up. Three, three, no, three, 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 four. Four. Three, three, four. Three, four, yeah. Three, four, go ahead, throw that right there. I set the hook and broke off on her. As I'm retying, he threw in, set the hook on another one, broke off on it. I don't know if it's saw guy or what, but. Probably. They, they absolutely. Eight something. Eight, Eight nine. nine. Good bag, fellas. Good yeah, job. that was a real good bag. All right, fellas. 
not enough today thought we had a chance for big we did we we lost by like three ounces i'm not mad at it it's a great fish we're gonna let her go and watch her swim off and let them divvy up the money see you, big girl so to cody and kyle all right thank you, sir. good job yeah. on your big fish my wow. friends appreciate you buddy yeah and then for total weight is myself and Dwayne with 8.9 pounds. Good job. Everybody caught fish. So better than normal at Taylorsville. <laughs> so. All right, guys. We could pull it off again today. You spoke uh, me today. We caught one. I'm not mad at it. Better than coming in empty-handed. Chris and Dwayne, shout out to them. Cody and Kyle, they both had great bags. Came up just a little short on big fish, but it is what it is. We were on them. I mean, I think we were doing the right thing. We just didn't come across the right caliber of bites that we needed. But next is the classic. Be a few weeks out. Hopefully, we're going to show up at Barron and take everybody's money there. But, uh, yeah, please be sure to like, comment, and subscribe. We'll see you.